County still searching for two men wanted for the murder of a young mother outside a fast food restaurant. It happened in District Heights over the weekend. Fox 5 is getting to show you more surveillance video of the crime that's devastated a large and loving family. Bob Barnard is live in the District Heights right now and with the latest with this investigation. Bob? Hey there, Shamari. In the surveillance video you're about to see, you get a pretty good look at the alleged gunman's face. A man wanted for murder after what appeared to be just an ordinary visit to this Subway sandwich shop here on Silver Hill Road in District Heights. First, a little more about the victim. This is Jessica Somerville, the 27-year-old Prince George's County woman shot and killed early Sunday morning. Her brother, T-Rock, says Jessica was an employee of the U.S. Postal Service and the mother of a precious little girl, six-year-old J.C. This is surveillance video released by Prince George's County Police, Jessica's last moments alive. We've blurred her image on the left there. You can see the two murder suspects on the right, inside the subway, also at the counter. It seems as though there may have been a brief interaction, but that's it. Then, minutes later, one of the suspects covers his face with his hat. Police say that's the gunman, the one who is now being sought for murder. Soon, the women leave the restaurant. The two men would quickly follow and walk straight to the victim's car, one on each side. You'll see the front driver's side door open. It appears the man with his face covered reaches in, and there's a struggle. And then, what was to be the fatal gunshot. Somebody else in the car gets out of the back seat and goes after the gunman. It's a brief struggle with punches thrown before that person runs away in what seems to be sheer terror. It is a man with a gun they were struggling with. Soon, the suspects leave the parking lot. Those with Jessica appear frantic over the realization she's been fatally wounded. Her family says Jessica had stopped at the subway with her U.S. Postal Service co-workers on their way home from their Saturday shift. Prince George's County Police are hoping somebody will recognize this man. If you know him, you'll know it's him. Police say people are calling crime solvers with tips. They're hoping the calls keep coming. And a $25,000 reward is being offered to the tipster who helps get the killers off the street and locked up, Sharin.